I'm a sugar daddy. Cat them with us. Hi, good form fam, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I will be doing a QA. and a um, I asked you guys on oh, I, a I asked you guys on Instagram and on my YouTube channel to ask me some questions so that I can do the sit down. I actually realized that I love sitting down and just talking and I've watched Q and a YouTube videos and I'm like, I would love to do one. You know why not and surprisingly like surprisingly i got like over 50 questions on instagram alone like i never expect anybody to ask me anything like really like if i never get any answer i would have just if i never get any questions i just scrap the video thing and just say okay but i got like over 50 questions and i only wrote down some of them because as you all know i'm using my phone to vlog so i cannot look at my phone and i also got like a handful on youtube so yeah i wrote down all those youtube ones because that means my subscribers wants to know more about me well it's not i get to know me but y'all know what i mean so i wrote down some questions i have 30 is this 30 and I wrote down 30 questions um from well between Instagram and YouTube and so I'm just going to answer them um the others that I did not answer trust the others that I did not include trust and believe it was just too much like people want to know way too much like rude too much um yeah y'all don't have any control <laughs> But um, I'm just going to get right into it. All right, so as I said, if I'm looking down, I'm looking in this book because I wrote the questions here. Um, this one actually came from YouTube. It's, it, the question is, what's your favorite TV series and why? Okay, so I just feel like well, if I things I'm gonna watch, I say, oh my God, it's my favorite. So I just don't feel like I really have a favorite but right now I am watching Ozark okay Ozark is back it came back on the 21st of January and your girl binge watching like if I turn the camera or no it passed because <laughs> I started watching it yesterday so right now I love um okay I love Ozark um I love uh, money heist um i love gossip girl like anything high school drama love it love it tv series yes like in the past few weeks i actually binge watch over the game like yeah with derwin and melanie yeah i i binge watched it like in a week because i love it so anything love it love it with drama and them look at something there yeah i love it okay so the next question is do you get lonely being away from your family well i wouldn't say lonely but i do miss them and i do miss just familiar faces you know just being here i so i would say you know it's i'm starting over so i know nobody so it can get lonely but i'm okay like there are video call away a phone call away and i can fly to jamaica if i want to so they're a flight away <laughs> but um yeah but um to really answer the question no it does get lonely sometimes sometimes but there as i said they're a call away flight away yeah <laughs> i miss my little niece kelly okay so question number three what do you love and dislike most about being in the u.s okay what do i love most about being in the u.s honey the opportunities okay opportunities left right and center you have more opportunities for growth um everything is easily accessible to you here if you i, I talk about my business good form like 
I'm here now like I have so many vendors that I can go to in person I can fly there do what I need to do to get my business up and running so the opportunities here are endless what I dislike about um, being in the US the most is white privilege I've experienced that recently I may share it in another story time I may not but the racism here is not nice at all um, I'm in Colorado for those who don't know so it's a white state um, we do have black people here but it is mainly white people and I have been getting some of that yeah I don't really like talking about the topic too much because it's very sensitive and people will misconstrue what you say all the time and so it's not something that I really like talking about but yeah it's just certain things here yeah that's that's one of the main things that I dislike the most but yeah okay so the next question is what what do you miss about Jamaica who said I miss Jamaica okay so to be honest like Jamaica Jamaica oh my born and bread who know this um and I do love my country but at the moment I'm not missing anything really not um when I was there like this is like something that is I just need a whole story time to really talk about what what I was going through early last year I really really need to do that story time persons actually asked me to share it and I'm going to I want to but I'm still thinking about it it's kind of like so personal too and I don't get personal on the internet like that you know it's so in-depth um I'm working on something and I have included it in it so hmm maybe I'll just wait until that drops <laughs> so stay tuned for that um but um, it's just the cliche things like the sunshine like okay I do love the cold like I really love cold but uh, sometimes you want that warm sun to hit your body for you to just relax sometimes like at the resort sometimes I go to the resort and I want to just go outside and lay on the bed but then there's no sunshine and there is snow so it's just that the cliche things what I will say I miss is the culture because you know the music my, my love my dance music like I love dance music I love to vibe I love to dance my love wine up myself yes all of that <laughs> I may not post a lot with them something there maybe one or two snippets of me doing things but my lo in, a mo when in my own space so go on with a bag of tea. <laughs> but yeah I play the music here I'm still I'm looking fun but you know just the culture the little sunshine the food oh my god yes the food I'm going crazy here I am going crazy sorry my sister just messaged me <laughs> the food but um yeah that's it there I, I i just okay i'm not going to say anything in this video but yeah just the just the regular cliche things like i would say the culture which is the music you know just seeing my people expressing themselves you know jamaica is a whole vibe honestly <laughs> And because I've been so busy, I mean, filming with YouTube, I work, you know, and some other things that I am working on. I hardly, I'm hardly on Instagram. Like, if I do post, I post and I get off. And one and two times, like, when we're just lying on the bed, I would just scroll through so I can really catch up for see, like, you know, what go on, what keep today in Jamaica. Nothing has changed, by the way. Nothing has changed. The violence, women, them just are kill them, children still like <sighs> Yeah. Which is going to bring me to my next question. Um I think and these questions so far are the questions that I got on YouTube. Um it's a what do you not miss about Jamaica? And honestly, I don't miss what I see in the media people just are dead left right and center women missing children missing thoughts slash you know um it i just i can't 
and I cannot tell when last I watched the news. Even when I was in Jamaica, I did not watch the news because I can't get the depression. Me don't need them sadness there. As a matter of fact, I went ahead and unfollowed because uh, I used to follow TVJ, I used to follow Glena, I used to follow some page. Like I unfollowed them, I come and literally just now want to see the negativity in my feed. Like that is how I am. The only way I'm going to the news is when somebody reposts something other than that. I never know. I can't take the negativity in my feed. I don't want to see the dead body in my feed. The yellow tape and the. Yeah. Mm -mm. Nope. Definitely don't miss that. Alright, so so far I was doing Instagram questions. Sorry, YouTube questions. So now I'm just going to jump over to some <laughs> Instagram questions. Alright, um, so this question, the, where do I start? Okay, how do you maintain yourself in the US? I have a sugar daddy. <laughs> Alright, for that joke aside, um, I work. <laughs> Can't tell what I see. <laughs> okay, guys, I work. Like, I'm a working woman, okay? I work, so that's how I maintain myself. No sugar daddy, nobody not give me nothing. I'm a work, my hard earned money, I'm a save, I'm a budget. Yeah. Girl independent. <laughs> next question. Okay, next question. I love when I get questions about my sister. Okay, how did you and your sister became so close? All right, well, I mean, I came back from overseas in 2000 and, and Tasha can correct me, it's which year, 2017. I came from overseas and an apartment was empty next to her, so I moved in. Like, I was there on the day when the person I moved out, the landlord never have anybody, somebody just moving. And from there, our relationship started to grow, we started to spend a lot of time together, we talk about the past and we just unload yeah and isn't it never happened overnight but now that's my ride or die baby <laughs> but yeah like any relationship it just all you have to do is just talk both of you just need to talk um yeah and uh, work things out and honestly i love my sister to death right now like literally nobody can come between me and my boo like that's my baby <laughs> nobody can come between me and my sister like nobody no friend no boy no girl nobody <laughs> but yeah we just talk um because we're we have a past you know so we talked about that and we just work on it spend time with each other as i said and trust me the two we the two we are fire fire the two we have attitude so we go at it. <laughs> so don't think that it's perfect, but at the end of the day, we'll come right back together because where I go, Miss Too Fine, big up yourself, love you, miss you. Okay guys, honestly, I never thought I would get so in depth with this q and I thought it was just going to be like a one sentence answer go along, but I just love the que these questions and I just couldn't just give like a one sentence. So it seems as if I'm going to have to actually cut this um q a in two parts right so i'm going to answer two more questions and then my other video i will answer the other questions and if anybody have any questions you can comment them down below and i will also answer them or answer them in, in part two so i'm just going to answer two more questions in this video and then i will continue in part two but yeah all right so do you want to have children absolutely i love babies like i want to be a mom i know i would be a really good mom yes i want children i don't know like i used to say like i want four but honestly i just i don't know you know whatever god whatever god wants me to have that's what i'll have but yes i want children very soon very soon <laughs> but um yeah um yeah so okay i'm going to answer one more question i don't know which one of these um are you going to do more cooking videos yes sis yes i think it's, i know who i know who asked me this question yes 
I'm going to do more cooking videos. I was explaining that I left my tripod in someone's car, and so yeah. But um, I did a cooking video, yes, and posted it today. So go check that out. But yes, I'll be doing more cooking videos. Okay, so yeah, you guys, that's it for part one of the Q and A session. I really enjoyed this. Like, honestly, Jesus, <laughs> sorry, I really enjoyed it. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys in part two and of course if you have any questions you can always comment down below ask me I will be sure to answer them um, And yes, yeah, so I'll see you guys in part two Bye